Hi, Tracy Eaglemeyer here from VintagepreneurUniversity.com, where I help vintage sellers start, grow, and scale their business on Etsy. I also own my own vintage business, Rustic Eye, that I've had on Etsy since 2013. And today I'm going to answer the question that comes up a lot. Should I open a second Etsy shop? Generally speaking, my answer to that question is no. For most people in most circumstances, it wouldn't be a very good idea to have a second Etsy shop because it takes so much effort and time and resources to make one Etsy vintage business successful. To be able to do it twice would be extremely difficult for one person. Just ask yourself, what are you doing for your existing Etsy vintage business? It's probably a lot, am I right? So imagine having to do that for a second Etsy vintage business because that's essentially what you would be doing. You would be opening up a second business. So you wanna ask yourself, you know, why is it that you're considering opening a, first, an, a second shop in the first place? Is it because you have some items that are very different from the items that are already in your shop? If that's the case, then you probably want to consider selling those items if you just have them and you know you don't want to put them in your Etsy shop because you don't want it to take away from your brand, then why not sell them someplace else like on Facebook Marketplace or eBay or anywhere else but in your Etsy shop? Is it that you really like this other thing too, but you know you're afraid of combining it into your existing Etsy vintage business? Well, that's probably where you need to just kind of consider what your goals are. If you really are trying to grow a successful business, then maybe you need to just tell yourself, no, I don't, you know, I'm not going to worry about trying to sell other things. I'm gonna focus on what I'm selling right now and what is working. I've had to do that several times myself. You know, there's other things that I start to get kind of sidetracked on and then I would say, you know, nope, that's not what I'm doing here. That's not my business right now. I'm gonna come back and focus on what I set out to do. And that doesn't mean that I haven't changed my niche a little bit here and there and made changes, but I've done it all within the confine of what my goals are for my Etsy shop now and in the future. Is the reason you're considering opening a second shop because you're hoping that if you have a second shop that'll help to bring in more business? Well, here's the thing. You might get, you probably will get sales from the second shop, but at what cost from your at first shop because you're taking away your time and your resources and your focus away from that first shop to work on the second shop. So is it really worth it to do that or should you put all your resources and focus into your existing business? I say the later. Okay, now there are some exceptions to this quote unquote rule. I've seen having two shops work well under a couple circumstances and one, it's that there is you know, for example, a husband and a wife team who both work on both shops, but one primarily works on one and one primarily works on the other. Well, that makes sense because you have two people both in charge of running their own business. So that, that I have seen work and can work. Another possibility of where it might be an okay idea to open up a second Etsy shop is if you have somebody else who is can work for you. So um, maybe it's a, you know, an adult child or a parent or a friend. If you have somebody else who's helping you with that, then that could make sense if that's something that you want to explore. Generally speaking, for most people running an Etsy vintage business in most circumstances, stick to your one vintage shop and put your efforts there. You know, unless you have some kind of superhuman powers and then by all means, prove me wrong and go ahead and do it. All right, so if you liked this video, make sure to give it a like, subscribe to my channel and click the little bell as well so you get notified whenever a new video comes out. If you'd like to get some more of my secret tips and resources, I have something set up just for you. You can check it out at vintagepreneuruniversity.com slash secret and I'll link to that below for you as well. Thank you so much for joining me today and have a great rest of your day. Bye.